Hello, it's Josh from ServerPro here, and today we'll be setting up SSH for your VPS. Secure Shell, or SSH, is a protocol used to remotely connect to and manage servers via a command line interface. It essentially allows you to access your VPS's console, as displayed in your ServerPro control panel, from your computer directly. This has many advantages, including easier management of multiple servers, the ability to increase your font size, and many other really useful features. It also allows you to access your server's files via SFTP. To set up SSH, navigate to your ServerPro account, then click the control panel button next to your server. Next, open the shell tab and type in nano slash etsy slash ssh slash sshd underscore config and hit enter. This command will open the SSH configuration file with the Nano text editor. Using your arrow keys, scroll down to the line that contains port 22. Notice that it starts with a pound sign. This means that it's commented out. Remove the pound sign to uncomment the line. Then scroll down to the line that contains permit root login prohibit password and uncomment this also. On this same line change prohibit password to yes. These are the only values that we need to change. Note that these are not the most secure settings and in a production environment we would recommend securing SSH properly, but these settings will be sufficient for most users. To save the file, press Ctrl X, then Y, and finally hit Enter. Now that we've got SSH configured, we just need to start it and make sure that it starts on boot. Type in System Control Enable SSH to ensure that SSH is started on boot then run system control start ssh to start the service. You can then run system control status ssh to check whether it's running or not. To access the server via ssh, we're going to need to give the root user a strong and complicated password. Whilst in the shell tab, enter in password and press enter. You will then be prompted to enter your password and confirm it. Nothing will be displayed on the screen, but characters are being entered. If you're running Windows, you're going to need to install an application called Putty to connect to your server via SSH. We've left a download link in the description. If you're running macOS or Linux, you can skip to the next section as you can just use your built-in terminal. Open the Putty install that you've downloaded and proceed with the installation as with any other program. Once Putty is installed, open it up and you'll be presented with a screen that looks like this. Enter your server's IP address in under hostname and leave the port as the default. Next, click on Open and you'll be asked to enter a username and password. Enter root for the username and the password we set up earlier for the password. You should then be connected to the server. Connecting to your server via SSH is much simpler on macOS and Linux. Simply open up your terminal, which can be found under Applications Utilities on macOS or your application list on most Linux desktop environments and enter in SSH root at your server's IP address. Then type in yes to add the fingerprint, followed by the password we set up earlier. As always, if you've enjoyed the video, hit the like button, subscribe and click the notification bell to ensure that you never miss a video from Server Pro. Make sure to also leave a comment down below telling us what you'd like to see from us in the future. I've been Josh, cheers.